I've been reflecting on the first time that I I prayed and I kept thinking of this time when I was on this bike. I'm pretty sure this is the first time I remember praying and I was going down a really steep hill and I was so scared and I started shaking and I think my my tire hit a rock and it bent the frame of the tire and so I was swerving all down this really steep hill and this car started to come up and I was so scared. I was like, oh no, what am I going to do? I need to jump off this thing. And I remember at that moment, I just, it surprised me that it came out of my mouth. I said, um, God, I will pray every day. If you just let me live, <laughs> just save me. And, um, of course, of course I'm here. Of course I'm okay. Got a few bumps and bruises. Um, but as a kid, I, you know, I, I really sat with that. Like I had a, an impact on me that calling out for, um, for God's help. And I was like, Oh, okay. Now I owe this debt. Now I need to pay up. I need to pray every day. And I remember, I think it was a, a, just a few weeks that I started praying and it was, you know, very, I, I won't, you know, go into it in too much detail, but it was, you know, just very much on the surface level, but it did open up this doorway for me. And I started to, as an adolescent, um, turn to God and, and just talk, I just talk whenever I was having, um, problems in my life or, you know, issues were coming up. I never went there when I was feeling good, um, when I was a kid, but I'll say that the way that I pray has evolved so immensely. And when I was younger, it was very transactional. It was very tit for tat. You do this, I'll do this. Take care of me. It was very self-centered <laughs> and, now it's um it feels much more relational and even beyond that like feels unified i feel unified with the creator when i'm in prayer and that's where i begin whenever i am praying silently or with others um i begin by establishing that connection that unification and lifting my attention and my focus to being in the presence of god um I sometimes start my prayers with, I feel you here. I know your spirit flows here. I open to you now. May I be comforted by you. And um, even then I've come to realize that just walking and acknowledging the beauty of life, I say, thank you. Thank you. That's a prayer. That's, you know, this is a prayer for me. It's this unification. And um, I come to realize that in this, when we enter this prayer space, when we enter this unification with the creator, I am accessing this realm of possibilities. I am lifting myself up, reaching towards the heavens. And I feel like the heavens are meeting me and meet, meeting me where I'm at and meeting me in the middle. And where there's this exchange of energy between heaven and the earth that I'm holding and accessing this realm of potential and bringing, you know, speaking in a way that um, brings life that is in alignment with life. Right. So um, I try to be very mindful of my language. So instead of saying something like, I want more joy in my life, it's a very different vibration to say, um, thank you for opening my heart uh, to receive even more joy and love. Um, joy is welcome here. There's a very different vibration. You know, when I say I want, it kind of implies that I'm, I'm lacking. It's not there. But when I speak from a place of, I know it's here, I open to it and, and I create space for it. It just, it, it flows. And it, it has revealed to me again and again that yes, it is there. Um, I just need to open myself to it. 